Susan, that male victim shot in the elbow but expected to recover. Meanwhile, those two suspects still outstanding, outstanding, last seen running that way and not with a getaway driver. Are you guys doing okay, ma'am? That's how those inside during the home invasion say they're doing. One of the women and a child just trying to get back to normal after two men broke into their home and shot a man inside. Our victim comes out and says, I've been shot and it hurts. And at that same moment, the friend in the vehicle saw the two individuals running down the driveway. L.A. County Sheriff responded to the call 430 Sunday morning off Longdon Avenue. When they arrived, they found two women zip tied inside along with a two year old. The male victim was driven to the hospital by a friend who had just dropped him off. He was immediately confronted inside the house by two individuals who demanded money from him. Deputies say the suspects were waiting inside the victim's house before shooting him and making off with two grand. Investigators spent the entire day collecting evidence and interviewing neighbors. That's really scary. Those who live nearby say they're pulling for their neighbor and say this is a reminder it can happen next door. Well, yeah, we've been having a big problem for years now of uh, burglaries in the city. And uh, we've been having people trespassing in our properties. Recently got it under control. And uh, it seems to be better now around here. But it still happens in, on occasions. Sheriff says robberies have increased in the area. It's worth noting that the baby was unharmed and the only person that was injured was that person that was shot that is, of course, expected to survive. Reporting in Temple City, Travis Rice, Fox 11 News.